So here we have a math lesson. It has an equation on it and some different tools, but there's no directions. We're going to use sticky notes to add some directions here. So I'm going to go to the magic box, which is located here in the main toolbar. Then I'm going to choose the sticky note icon in the main toolbar. In order to use a sticky note, all you have to do is touch and drag it onto the canvas. Here we can annotate immediately, change the colors down here change the pen width or use the trash can to erase everything. Since these are directions though, I'm going to use the text editor, which is the T here. Then I'm going to change the font size because this default font size is way too little. We're going to choose something like 56. And then I'm going to bold it so it kind of stands out and we're just going to type math directions. Now for my next line, I want it to be a little smaller. So let's go ahead and change the font size down to something a little smaller. And then we're going to get rid of bold by touching the B again. We're going to do the number one because this is the first step in our directions. And we'll say have students graph on the coordinate plane the X, Y coordinates for the equation. Step two will be to discuss and agree as a class on the coordinates. And then step three is going to be graph using Desmos, which you can see over there on the left. When you're finished with your sticky note, go ahead and close the X. I'll get my sticky note over here. It's kind of like the preview. Now, in order to use or move my sticky note, I do have to have the select tool activated, which is here in the main toolbar. It's the green arrow. This lets me move my sticky note. And then if I double tap it, it opens it up so I can actually read it. Let's go to this next page to see one more example. Here we're using a background from the My View Board original content. We're doing To Kill a Mockingbird, and I've put a bunch of blank sticky notes here for my students so they can drag them in. So for example, in setting, I can drag my sticky note in, double tap it, and then we're just going to use our annotations to annotate inside the sticky note. When we're finished, close the sticky note. From here, we can use the select tool in the main toolbar to move it around or double tap it to open it.